the Senate delaying a vote to protect same-sex marriage rights nationwide until after the midterm elections. There was talk that a vote could happen as soon as Monday. But today, the bipartisan group of senators negotiating the bill said they needed more time. The big push for this bill came after the Supreme Court overturned abortion rights under Roe v. Wade, and Justice Clarence Thomas suggested that same-sex marriage rights could be next. NBC News senior national political reporter Sahil Kapoor now. Sahil, is the delay really a matter of needing more time, or is it that senators just don't want to debate the bill in the run-up to the midterms? Well, Tyler, the simple reason is that Democrats do not have the votes to pass the bill right now. They need at least 60 votes in the Senate to break a filibuster. That means a minimum of 10 Republicans. And right now, you can barely even count to five Republicans. Uh, this is a turnaround for Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer, who, as you mentioned, had, had planned on initiating uh, the process of voting today to vote next week. Now he says it'll uh, be held until November or December after the election. This is after consultation with uh, Democratic senators, uh, including Tammy Baldwin and Kirsten Sinema, who are leading this uh, effort for his party. They're working with Republicans like uh, Rob Portman, who is an original co-sponsor of this, who argue that it would take the political sting off Republicans if they were to vote after the election. Specifically, there are a lot of conservatives in their party base that don't want to see Congress uh, codify same-sex marriage. And it, it, the argument from some Republicans is that you will get more votes if you wait. Now, this is a gamble because there's no guarantee that those Republicans will actually vote for this after the election. And there's been some dissent within the Democratic Party about the strategy. Senator Elizabeth Warren of Massachusetts has argued that the Senate needs to vote now and that Republicans should either support this bill or have to explain to voters why they didn't and be held accountable. It's, of course, an issue that uh, plays in favor of Democrats because of growing uh, majority support in this country, all over the country, really, uh, for legal same-sex marriage. When the vote happens is a little bit unclear, but uh, what we learned today, the news from Senator Schumer, is it will be after the uh, November 8th midterm election. Tyler. Sawhill, thank you very much. Sawhill Kapoor reporting for us.